In this video, I'll show you how to enable DLSS 4.5. First things you'll need to make sure you've got the NVIDIA app installed on your PC. You'll need to come into settings and then come into the about tab. And you'll need to basically make sure this checkbox here is ticked. Opt in to access beta or experimental features. Once you tick that, it'll force like a restart of the NVIDIA app, which will then kind of download the, the latest update. Uh, it, it should then give you version 11.0.6.374, which you can see I've already got here. Then you'll need to come into drivers and you'll need to make sure you've got the latest driver. Now that is version number 591.74. You'll need to just make sure you've got that. You can see released uh, as of January 5th, 2026. Once that's installed, you can do this on the global settings, but I normally do it on a per game basis purely because it makes it a bit easier when I'm testing stuff. Down in the game settings to DLSS override here, and it'll probably have it just set to global by default. Now, there are two ways in which you can enable DLSS 4.5. The easiest way is to probably just set it to the latest here, and if you hit apply, you can see it's going to override it with the latest, which will be using DLSS 4.5. There is another way in which you can come into custom, Go into super resolution here and you'll get obviously all of the different presets the newer ones are l and m now there are some differences between l and m i haven't really had too much of a chance to really see the the differences i know i think one or the other has slightly better quality and worse performance where the other one's got better performance slightly worse quality if you do set it to the latest here from my knowledge that will be using the preset m once you've got that setting changed in the nvidia app so you can see i've, I've changed it to the latest here but i've only done it for black myth wukom all i need to do is boot that game uh, enable dlss in the game and it'll be using the new dlss 4.5 instead of the old one this should work for any gpu rtx 20 series and up so hopefully this video has been helpful in getting you set up with DLSS 4.5. Let me know if you have any issues and I'll try and respond in the comments. And uh, hopefully I'll catch you in the next one.